morning, good night, good afternoon to my fellow viewers. In today's video, I will be discussing the topic of whether coffee the gadget tuber should credit or not. Before I begin this video, I'd just like to say that this video is solely based on my opinion, and it's fine if you disagree, just please be respectful in the comments. Coffee is a gadget tuber with over 200,000 subscribers, and she usually makes trends whether original or not. Now, I won't be talking about whether she's overrated or not because it would be quite irrelevant to the whole entire video, but if you want, you can go in the comments and discuss that. Now, I'm sure the first thing that comes in your mind is, of course she needs to credit, that's other people's work she's taking. And yes, that is plagiarism because she is not acknowledging the real creator nor making them feel appreciated anymore. But I'd also like to point out that Coffee does credit the creators, it's just in a portion of her video she doesn't. Coffee has actually made a response to this basically saying that gadget tubers who have like over like 2k to 15k who get a lot of views don't usually credit and she doesn't understand why she always gets the bad end of the stick. She also states that it's very hard to find the original creators of the trend when thousands of people do it at around the same time. To conclude this video, I'd just like to say that if you're joining a trend and you know you're not the original, please just put not original in the description after making a lot of effort to find the original creator. And if you are an original creator who's making a trend and you notice it blows up, please just put original in the title so people can know that you are the original creator. Anyways, that was it for the video. Stay tuned, my angels.